Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some popper slivers, and we don't want to die roll. So uh, let's get into this thing. And well, it's a keepable hand. It's not the best hand, though. We'll keep it. Unfortunately, we don't have the first turn one drop. Uh, but we can start setting up our board, which will be nice. I miss playing this during the week. I can only ever play Popper Slivers on the weekend nowadays. Usually I can only play like one day where I'm setting up uh, videos for the entire week. So I'm just cranking out all the videos and uploading them for the entire week and then uh, doing the recordings here and then I don't really get a chance to play during the week like I used to. So it feels like it's been a while since I've played, but it's only been a week. It just feels like it's been longer. Are we playing this thing again? Alright, we can beat this thing, no problem. We got a Blossoming Sands, that's nice, but we're just gonna drop Lords. We'll drop the Blossoming Sands next turn. And, uh, drop our other Lord. Get cranking. So, it takes, um, a few turns to really get cranking here. Uh, unless they're just on the Mono Black Control route, which they might be, but last time we were involved with this... They set up for some big combos, so maybe it's it's just mono black control. Oh, no, it looks to be mm. variant on mono black control. Okay. Well then, this is gonna get interesting. Other well, plated. Well then. I think I'm gonna... Winding way? Now? I don't really want to dump my muscle sliver to more removal. Hmm. Let's do winding way first. I can dig it. We'll just set up the board. Probably drop Benevolent and one of our Lords, our Muscle. Yeah, Benevolent and our Muscle. It's too bad. If we get another, like, Fivalent or something, that'd be nice. Oh, what? Well, now you're destroying my lands? Oh my gosh. Alright, never mind. Change of plan. Looks like we're getting wrecked. Ice Quake. All right, well, we, we got it back anyways, so uh, let's tr do the same plan here. Get some protection going. Pass the turn. So this is, seems to be a variant of the Model Black Control with some ramp. Pretty interesting. I'm going to draw another card. Okay. Well, that's nice. We got extra protection there. Um, how do I want to run this? Wish we had a flanking. That'd be very nice. I want to get stuff out of range, so I think we'll just do this and pass. I don't want to get hit by any more disfigures. They had to have drawn some more land by now, right? No? Pass the turn with no lands, please. I would love that right now. Give us a second to catch back up here. What you got? Come on. 
I think next turn I will mm -mm, they pay for life rather than and they okay we're gonna vines first because I want to set up the benevolent for the thorn move next turn because we'll, we'll go to blocks. If they block with Thorn, we'll give protection from black, and then uh, the Death Touch won't hurt it. That's not bad. That's not bad. I wish we could play more than one white, though. That's, that's an issue. Uh, I'm going to go Sentinel. Do that. See if they want to do the block. Now we may lose one of our creatures on their turn if we sacrifice Benevolent Bodyguard here, but we can refresh with Sinew next turn. But I think it'll be worth it to get this Thorn out of here, and then we'll become the Monarch, I believe, too. They're thinking. No? Okay. Then we're gonna do this. Ooh, they set up for something here. Okay, negative two. All right, well, we're getting for some damage. Unfortunately, we don't get the trade sucks, but we do get a card draw. And a forest is not what we need. But if they're still mana screwed here, we'll be in pretty good shape. Blossoming Sands. Alright, well, we finally get... Finally get that. Okay, well... I think I'm gonna just go ahead and dump one of my creatures to this thorn. We'll get in for at least 9 damage. And... Yeah, maybe it's not... Oh, okay. Alright, they don't want to see it. Okay. They, uh, they got mana screwed a little bit. They had such a good start, too. It's unfortunate. I think we're going to bring in Apostle's Blessing. Uh, I don't know if they play with enchantments. Uh, Relic might be good. Sunlance also. I think we'll dump one more journey. We'll get rid of Spinnerets. Do we need Relic? I think having one in is not a bad idea. Especially if they're playing with, like, Gurmog Angler, so... I guess let's, uh... Drop one Winding Way. And... Drop one Sidewinder? Yeah. We'll drop one Sidewinder. I'm fine with that. Let's go to game two. That's scary that for a second there. First couple turns, I was like, oh, we're just toast right now. But we managed. Got my Arizona raspberry iced tea. I'm addicted to these things. All right. Maybe it's a better choice to bring in another journey and take out, like, one Sunlance. Because I, I really feel like they got to be playing with Gurmogs, and Sunlance is only going to hit that Thorn Girl. So, I don't know. I'm playing based off of what I saw in that game, but uh, chances are they're playing with Gurmogs.
All right. Back to it. Hmm. I don't like this hand. I really do not like this hand. Two cycle lands and a tap land with one creature. Well, two creatures, but... <sighs> yeah, I'm going to toss that. All right, this is better. I'll keep this and... Gosh, what to toss? I guess we'll toss the plated. It's already going to be tough with all these tap lands coming in, so... Ugh, gosh, and another one. It's not good. We're going to be really slow. Gonna go straight for that draw two cards, lose two life. Gonna get their swamp. Alright, we'll play out Benevolent. I don't know if he'll survive though. I feel like he won't. We could protect him. Don't know if that'd be worth it. Yeah, negative two, negative two. No. All right, we got to get the removal out of their hand, one way or another. And their mana is online, pretty decent right now, so we'll uh, go ahead and cycle this land. And another tranquil thicket. Not exactly an ideal pull. But we'll do this, and. Uh, I guess we'll just drop our Viverlin here. Pass the turn. Chances are it's going to go bye bye We'll be able to start home up protection next turn. Uh, be nice to draw into some more creatures. If not, we may be forced to just winding away for a turn. And there's the disfigure. Can't do anything about it. Another winding way. Ugh. Yuck. I want to be able to dump a lot of creatures in one turn, so... Now. Now I think... I am just going to play this tapped so we can set up to play two things a turn. I think that'd be the best. Mm, just some more bait, I guess. We gotta try to get stuff out of range with our muscle slivers. So now at this point, drawing one more land, one more forest would be to our benefit. Drop two lords and keep up the vines for protection. But if we just get more creatures, that's fine, too. He's got six cards in hand, and now he's kind of flooding out a little bit. Could see a Gurmog uh, soon. Maybe next turn. I'll we'll probably want to wait till they get this completely to cover the cost. What was the deck that did these peat bogs and stuff? Was it the Delve combo that did all that? I think so. Well. Okay. There it goes. And we get a plated. Not bad, so I think we're actually just going to play it out as such, play it out as such, and hold up vines. Really protect our lord here. Mm. 
Mmm. Very nice. Mmm. That's unfortunate. So, do we want to take the chance and vines our muscle sliver while we have the chance, or just let this happen? Well, we'll go like this, just in case. Alright, they're going to the next phase. Do you have something? They don't have anything here. We're in good shape. Drop another Lord, hold up finds again. Totally down for that. Excellent. Excellent. Cool. We can start attacking. Look at that. your play here. Is this music too loud? Sorry if it is. Alright, they're gonna add a bunch of mana, huh? This should get interesting. Snuff out. Alright. Boom. I like it. Glad we held on to the vines. Three cards left in hand for them. And they're at ten life. Let's see what they do here. Oh no. That's that sucks. Yep. Bye bye. It's good control. Thankfully we got a couple lords in our hand. Draw me a forest. Okay. Alright, well. Hmm. Alright. We'll start this up again. At least we can rebuild. Crippler Apts is so gnarly. I got another land, so that's fine. Snuff out. Alright. Slowly but surely, we're gonna get back there. Another forest, so now we can, uh... Drop a winding way, refill. Nice, I love that. Start putting some more stuff down. Drop two lords next turn. Yeah, draw your cards. That's not good, though. I don't want him to draw those cards. Play a creature. I'll, I'll sunlance it. Cycle, draw some more cards. Oof, oof. They took, oh, they took life from that, too. Dang. Well, good on you for finding that, because you were basically dead next turn if you didn't. Forest. Alright. Pop that. Pop that. Go ahead. Ah, that sucks. Okay. Oh, man. He's going for the gold. <laughs> he's got four cards. What does he have in his hand? Holy crap. How do you not have an answer right here with four cards in your hand? At least like a Gurmog or something. He needs, like, double Gurmog here. I'll actually be shocked if I don't see a Gurmog. Sure. And you just took one life from that. Alright. 
Uh, Dark Ritual. Pulling out all the stops. Each of these got one damage. Oh my gosh. But each player. Isn't that going to kill him? Deals two damage to each creature in each... Okay. Well, seems like <laughs> they had the answers, just not the ones they wanted. Why does this deck go so hard on hurting themselves? Like... It's such a, such a, every, like half their cards hurt themselves. Uh, sign in blood, snuff out, uh, let's see, what else does, what were the other ones? Is there one more? Rancid Earth, right? Yep, Rancid Earth and Justice. It's a lot of damage to yourself. I don't know, but... Oh well, they couldn't get there, and, uh, you know, <laughs> that's all they could do. They just took way too much damage, so hopefully you guys enjoyed watching this interesting version of a mono black control. Uh, I like seeing kind of the new take on it, but looks like it needs some more revisions, so. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed those. Subscribe for more Popper Slivers, and we will see you guys in the next video.